What's up, my lock loves? So happy to talk to y'all again. Oh my God. If you have been contacting me, telling me about my videos or inquiring services because you watch my YouTube videos, hey, like I love when y'all contact me. Uh, y'all just make me feel so special that you watch my videos and then just still wanna, you know, get it. Like it's just, it's just weird, but I love it. So if you are a subby, I love you so much. And you know, you're OG subby because we just hit 200. And you know, when we hit the thousands, y'all were here first, okay? Mm. So I'm gonna make this video on why I'm no longer doing lock extensions. And um, <clears throat> it makes me sad. It does make me sad because I was envisioning having this whole lock extension business. Like I was finna get into it, installing and making lock extensions. I was about to be a lock extension empire, like like making styles and like lock sanity. Like I was trying to get it like them, but I do have to stop making lock extensions and installing them. That is the crochet method and that is the wrap method. Let me tell y'all why. My number one reason <clears throat> is that I now have something called trigger finger with my left thumb. And I'm going to post what trigger finger is, but basically me making lock extensions for so many hours every single day has caused um, inflammation within, with my left thumb. So this finger, I'm holding like this while I'm um, making the locks, while I have to wrap the locks, it don't matter. My thumb is constantly like this and it's a lot of pressure because I'm holding the hair um, while my right hand is actually making the locks. So over time, after so many hours out of day, every single day, um, it's now causing inflammation in, in my thumb, which is very painful and it's causing it to not move correctly. So I got trigger finger and the only way to resolve it is to stop doing what I was doing to cause it. And if I don't stop, then I'm going to have to have surgery to resolve the issue. So I, I put my health first and I decided to no longer make lock extensions to, to, to solve my trigger finger, right? My number two reason why I'm no longer doing lock extensions is because they take so freaking long to make them. So not to brag or anything, but I do have other businesses that I am, that I'm doing. You know, I have a candle business. I'm trying to study for my real estate license. Uh, I have a sunglasses business. Like I have businesses that I'm trying to grow and I cannot grow it if I'm spending all day, every day making lock extensions. Like it literally takes 10 to 20 minutes to make a lock extension depending on the size and the length. And when you order 80, 100, 120 lock extensions, that takes me three or four days per order. So y'all can only imagine if I have several orders, how I'm just doing this day in and day out and it's taking up all my time, all of it. So that's my number two reason. Number three, and um, I guess I'll make this, no, 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 let's just do number three. Number three, Lock extensions are super painful to make. My God, like even without the finger protectors that I um that I use, well, even with the finger protectors that I use, they're super painful. If you don't use finger protectors, which covers your fingers, then the needle will be digging in your thumb, digging in your fingers. But you know, I thought I solved that with my finger protectors. No, the motion itself. It causes pain in your arms, your hands, your fingers, 
Like, it is so painful. And like I, how I said, I was doing them day in and day out. So that pain is, mm, it's, it's, it's super painful. It's super painful. And I, I can't take it no more. Along with the trigger finger. That's a whole, that's a delayed pain that I have to deal with. But, you know, while making them, it's painful. And number four, I'm going to let this be the last one. Um, it's super hard to satisfy people with lock extensions because you, I can only, the customer can only go off by pictures on what they want. Now, I can make them as close to those pictures as, as, as I can, but honestly, each lock extension is different. Um, I can only make a roundabout on the size that, you know, if you say you want small, I want to try my best to make it a small, but each lock extension is different. And so also you want small, I don't know what small is to you. I only know what small is to me. And yeah, you know, we can go by the ruler, but honestly, you have to see it and feel it to know if this truly is what you want. So it's super, it's kind of hard to please customers when you can't really have the experience of them feeling it and, and all that. Like I could send out like a test lock and after the test lock, they were like, okay, yeah, I like it, don't like it. But I don't know. Whatever. That that last one is subjective subjective to each each person that makes lock extensions. So needless to say, I'm no longer making lock extensions. I'm no longer installing lock extensions. And if you are a stylist, you need to be charging appropriately for lock extensions, because it ain't no joke. And if you are a customer, you need to be paying appropriately for those lock extensions. Like I know lock extensions that go into the hundreds. You're gonna be paying three to eight hundred dollars, maybe even a thousand dollars, depending on what you want. And trust and believe every penny is accounted for, like is it's worth it. Like if you knew what people go through to make those lock extensions, you would gladly pay the money. So stylists charge appropriately and customers pay. Okay. Like it ain't no joke. So good news of me not making lock extensions. My wrap lock extension, um, my Lee locks. I'm actually going to give y'all the tutorial on how I make those extensions because it's no longer my money maker. I can't make no money from it no more. So I'm, I'm going to give you all a tutorial on how to make those extensions. If you are a stylist, be sure to look out for that video. You know, give your girl her props. But until the next one, peace. Give me a reason and I'll pretend I'm in control just like the sea.